Mini Apival of our Village Marine Tech Little Wonder 250 RO unit. We bought the framed model and mounted it on a board and mounted that board with two screws in the aft cabin. By doing it this way, we can remove two screws, leave two small holes, and the entire unit vanishes from the boat and can be reused. This unit has parallel RO membranes. In an emergency, I could bypass one and still get water. This is the sound of the normal RO unit working. I'll let it come up to its normal level inside our aft cabin. It normally runs at about 800 PSI. Although it's rated at about 10 gallons an hour here in the Sea of Cortez, this gauge is telling me only about 8 gallons an hour. In reality, it's probably about 7.5. This unit is rated at 250 gallons a day or 10 gallons an hour. And as I said, with, this is running about seven and a half to eight gallons an hour. Take a look at what that looks like in reality. When choosing a water maker for yourself, think about how long you're going to spend babysitting this as we don't leave ours running when we're not aboard the boat. In the heat of the Sea of Cortez, if we're not using the unit, we normally back flush it about once every three or four days. If it's going to be longer, we pickle it.